Hello Lulas, welcome back to my channel. Guys, if you're not subscribed, please make sure you go ahead and subscribe now. If you're not a part of the notification squad, that means you need to click the bell to be a part of the notification squad. Also guys, if you have not joined the chat box, make sure you do so by joining, by clicking the join button next to the subscribe button. Or if you don't see a join button, the link is in the description bar. Also, there are merch. But today, I am showing you Baby Prim, and she is the last um, little silicone preemie that I painted for a friend, cuss slash customer. <laughs> um, I don't typically do customs, but um, I have taken a few here or there over time. This video is mainly for her mommy as we're waiting for her hair to come in so that I can root her. And I'll probably reroot her eyelashes as well because I feel like these are kind of a little too straight. So, and then she'll she'll get whatever final touches that may, may or may not be needed. I'm gonna remove her socks and then I'm also gonna change her diaper. Um, and that way I will Mommy can see that she does fit two size diapers. She fits um, newborn. Now this bottle is not a bottle, not her bottle. This is my personal bottle. Um, actually, it was one of my Claritella baby bottles. And let's see. Okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's, let's do it. I got this to put her on. She like she's I said she's like 15, 16 inches. I can't remember exactly. Um she has an open mouth. And she has a cute little tongue inside. I don't know. Like you guys can see her little tongue goes it flaps, so to speak. I don't know how to explain that. But she will take a bottle. I don't want to use KY. Hang on. I don't want to use KY because I don't want to use too much, no nothing on her. Just in case I want to touch anything up in the end. I just don't want no products on her. So, but she does take a bottle. She will take the full bottle. And definitely, you just have to make sure, because like I said, she does have a tongue that does move. So you have to make sure that you put the bottle on top of the tongue and you're not pushing the tongue up towards the roof of the mouth or pushing it down. So, but she does, she will take a bottle and she will take... Um, I personally would probably give her more of the micro preemie pacifiers, but she will take a small, a very, one of the, the really small nipple, uh, pacifiers as well. Um, but again, that's her with her bottle. Um, she's, she's been mad in and everything, so she may have a shine spot here or there, but she, um, her paint is truly sealed. Um, she's had a couple washes and, you know, she hasn't lost any paint or anything. So, that's good. So, this is her and my little hand, you know. And then, um, she has, this is her belly button. She has a little cute little belly button. Let's show you guys her little, where's your belly button? Did a little belly button. Um, she, she is. So that's that's her. So, you know, it's just really fun when you. The good thing, the fun thing about doing customs is seeing different babies. So I was tempted to do others just because you get to see all the different sculpts that you normally wouldn't see in passing um and her little feet 
and mommy wanted her to have a prick so she has a cute little prick at the bottom of her feet and this is her little back and her head does turn from side to side so she she can lay this way or she will turn that way as well of course you know how it is they always favor one side more than the other um but again cute little bum bum so that is her um with silicone it is you know sometimes you are going to have some little um indiscretions here or there um and when i say that you know you might see a little bit of a paint stroke or something like that but overall i think she, i think she came out really good and i was really glad to be able to have the opportunity to paint her i did a little veining and a little bit of capillaries a little you know moles stuff like that little details um her mommy will see some more she has a birthmark she has different little things you know the little modeling little you know just little things that you know babies have when they're first born much less preemies are definitely even more so now this is a newborn diaper she has on i'm gonna put her on a preemie diaper And then I'm going to get her on her, oh, and her, her head is like painted and model and stuff like that in case mommy had decided to keep her ball, but she did decide to go with hair. So she's going to get her head full of hair. I'm going to root her. Lord help me. And her. <laughs> but, um. And this is a thing too, like this kit is fairly inexpensive um, con compared to, you know, what babies, the silicone market may be. But I'm finding that you can love and enjoy and make anything, you know, your own. You know what I mean? Like I really, really believe that. Um... You know, just, you know, a lot of people want to afford a silicone baby or have a full body in their collection. And I know that, you know, it's a lot of pressure of the popularity and stuff. And, you know, I collect, you know, very um, expensive dolls, but I also collect um, not as much as expensive dolls as well. Um, my collection kind of have a huge range in between. But I, I really, like I said, I really think that there's opportunities out there for 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 us we just have to look around and i've been exploring a lot lately and i've found some stuff i gotta be careful because i i i always paint the 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 bottom area super realistic so i don't want to show that but yeah the preemie diapers fit as well as the newborn so if mommy bought preemie diapers she's okay if she already has small newborn diapers she's okay if she don't want to go buy new ones um she does have like a little one little her little leg turn up and stuff or whatever but it works when you you know when you're doing the this pose it works so good because that little leg poses so you can make it work, um, I guess, it, you know, she doesn't have armatures or anything like that, but, you know, you can still give them a look. So this is just, you know, me just posing on the whim. Of course, you know, you can try to prop this and other, but as you can see, I, I'm just, she just in my lap and I'm, this is what i'm doing um so i do think she looks so cute on her tummy um also when you lay her like this and you can kind of 
kind of turn her to the side like that and you know get rid of this and then if you wanna and there you go if you wanna swaddle her or anything like that I didn't bring a pacifier over here let me see do I have one close by no but yeah um so that's that I would have shown her with a pacifier but she does look cute with a pacifier let me double check in my pockets like my, my, my goodie bag over here Let's see that would be a no oh I need to put this in my pacifier box I organized my pacifiers as well um today this is a nook and she probably could fit this but I would need to put K KY on it to to do it but um i'm pretty sure she can fit the nipple um the zero months because the nipple is very thin and it's very small and i'm sure she could fit it with you know using ky but i don't have ky here like i said i don't want to do that oh yeah i was gonna put her on this and then we're going to go and i am going to put her back in her little bed she how i just want you guys to know when your babies are with me they are treated like real babies and they do get a bed and they sleep in the bed and they have their little pillows they have their little binky beside them <laughs> because so she is waiting i don't play with the babies because they're not mine I'm doing this video for mommy to see and um, like see right here, she may have, she have this little line that happened where you have to blend that and if you don't catch it, this little cone will, will stay and it left that little line. So like, you know, every now and then you have that little hoopla, but the thing about it is once it's there with silicone, it's not the same as like vinyl. It's kind of there. Um, so, but, okay, mama. Right. So, let's, and she got a little nightgown on while she waits. And when I get rid of Ruta, I'll probably put her in a sleeper and then wrap her up in a blanket to try to keep as much hair off of her. And I know people wrap them up in like that wrapping plastic paper stuff. I don't, I hate that stuff. I hate the way it smells. So I don't, I don't use it for my kitchen. I don't use it for nothing. I don't, I just don't like it. What is it? Cellophane wrap or something like that. But anyway, that's her in her little gown. Um... Again, she she is poured in one piece, so her little head does turn, you know, it does wobble. She does, you know, so. And again, in her little gown, in her, on her tummy. So, let's thank a poo. <laughs> All right, guys, thanks for watching, and we will see you later. Oh, you know what? I didn't even ask mom if she wants me to pierce her ears. I don't have any earrings. But, yeah, but that's her. So, if you see in my arms, that's her. She's still, she's big enough to hold you know so anyway that's it that's baby prim top gonna be an auntie's girl <laughs>